Are you dreading another video work meeting? Do you wish you could just call into a meeting like the good old days? Are you tired at the end of the day from attending multiple video calls? Well, you might be experiencing video conferencing fatigue. Yes, it's a thing, a real thing. These days, we've not only been video conferencing for work, but also for maintaining connections with family and friends. That's a lot of video chatting. I just got off my third video meeting today. The thing that gets me about these video calls is maintaining constant eye contact, and you need to overly express yourself so the person can see your reactions. If you look away, it looks like you aren't paying attention. It's exhausting to pay close attention on video calls multiple times a day. Meeting overload was around even before the coronavirus pandemic. Over one quarter of professionals think meetings are unproductive or unnecessary, with nearly half of managers saying there are more meetings than required in a week. So what can managers do to help their teams ease the pain of video conferencing fatigue? I know most of you have been participating in many video meetings these days. I wanted to talk to you about some tips I have for managing video conferencing fatigue. Avoid multitasking and stay present. It's easy to get distracted by instant messaging or emails, but staying present will limit the amount of energy used during these calls. Multitasking can cost you as much as 40% of your productive time. Take breaks. On long calls while listening, turn off your camera at times to give your eyes a break from trying to read everyone's facial expressions. Take the meeting on a walk using your phone instead. Walking meetings are known to improve creativity and eventually reduce stress. Do what you can to support video breaks to help reduce video conferencing fatigue. Encourage your employees to make the best decision for their mental health. 